Just one person survived a crash that killed five people in Long Beach. It happened early this morning on the 710 freeway just south of the 91. Our Eric Resendiz talked with someone who saw the whole thing. He is live in Long Beach with more. Eric. Mark Giovanna, new information at first. Investigators said it was one teenager who died. Now the coroner says it was two teenagers. Both of them were 15 years old. As for that witness we talked to, they wanted to remain anonymous, but they did share that dash cam video that captured the tragic incident. We warn you, some viewers may find the video disturbing. Five people died in a violent crash and it was captured on camera. It happened on the 710 freeway heading north at the 91 freeway connector. The video shows the 2011 Hyundai Sonata driving down the freeway it ends up crashing head on into the attenuators. The car was fully engulfed in flames. Two of the victims were 15 years old, a boy named George Dobbs and a girl named Arias Slemaker. The driver with the dash camera who captured the crash wants to remain anonymous. As I was driving, I didn't realize that car was anywhere near me. So when he sped past me, I got really scared and I said, oh, dang, once he sped, he, like, he passed me, he ended up hitting the divider and he ended up flipping and I saw the fire start. The single car crash was reported just after 4 a.m. Air 7 HD video shows what the crash site looked like, but the car destroyed most of the damage to the front. The California Highway Patrol says it was a total of six people in the car, including the driver. Some of them were ejected from the car. At this time, I don't know the specific location of where everyone was seated, um, but we do know that, you know, seatbelts may not have been utilized, um, therefore, resulted in parties being ejected from the vehicle and as well as the fire that occurred right after um, for those who are still within the vehicle. The driver of the car died. At this moment, it's unknown if all of the occupants were related. The witness says she called 911. I didn't want to stop. The freeway is not a good a safe spot to stop at, to be honest, in that area. Um, so I just kept going. As for the freeway, it was closed for hours in the morning, but it has reopened. As for the cause of this incident, it's still under investigation. CHP says they have no update on the condition of the one person who was transported to the hospital. They did say he is a man and suffered critical injuries. We're now reporting live in Long Beach, Eric Resendiz, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.